So we out here at Ruffles Garage. Last night I didn't do shit. Um, my uncle was in the hospital. I want to go visit him. So step back at the same thing, and it's pretty dead right now. So nice and cloudy, no sun. Work on this car. Take out a dash. Hopefully today, and then tonight put the dash on another one. So. So, dash is out. It's over there. Um, there's nothing really big to it. Um, just the wire harness. It has a bunch of little screws here for the wire harness on the dash that you have to remove. Um, and just... That's about it. That's the only hard part. You got two right here. I think two right here that go right here. Um... As you can see, I had to remove also these, make it easier to um, take it out. You do have to take off the steering wheel um, and all these little sensors for the that go on the on the dash, which is the uh, automatic headlights, the alarm, the window switch, and that's it. I'm also swapping out the glass sunroof from that one to the plastic one over here um, and that one's pretty easy that one only has four bolts stars and you got one right here and one over there I took them off same here on the other side you got one over there one over there and then this just comes off like that so I'm gonna do the other one and then start working on the dash And just like that, the dash is out. Now, to put everything back together. And next are the rims and sports lid off. Then the tails. And I think that's it. Oh yeah, and the short rim. Oh, forgetting the exhaust also. So all this is gonna be for sale, tail lights, the black interior. The Magna Flow um, and probably stock rims. The sports list, no, no, no. Short ram, yes. Okay, guys, um, calling it a day. Reason being is because I gotta go to Fry's and they close at 9 and it's about 8 20 right now. I only did the driver side. This is already done. Um, I still got to do the center console and the passenger side, which that's going to be done tomorrow. Um, as far as now, I'm just going to clean up real quick, wash up, and head out to fries real quick before they close. So we out here at Rafa's Garage, finishing up this dash. Um, we're almost done. I'm not gonna put the center because I'm gonna swap out the stereo. Um, just gonna put little things here and there, like the window switch. I right, put this. Just gonna bolt it down and clean it up and put the pillar right now. Um, and that's about it. Um, should be ready for sale in a couple of days.
So now I'm taking out the sports lid. Uh, and I just put two fucking screws. Uh, the original one had rivets. I'll show you on the other one and how to take it off. Um, so this one's going to be fairly easy. The other one's going to be a pain in the butt. So these have rivets and the only way you're going to do it is by drilling them out. So use a drill, drill bit, drill them out um, and they should come off. So we're going to install this one which are wires or black is ground this is for the ignition or power one of these the red or the the red or the orange so one of them is power one of them is for the ignition until the stereo would turn on and then your purples are speaker same thing with the both that are gray the both that are white and both that are green and then your blue one is for your amp to tell when the amp is on and the other ones I'm not too sure um, some have to do with um, if it's video to let let it know when the e brakes on um, don't I forget what color that one is but since this one's already installed and we already know it, we're going to take off one wire by one wire. Um, and I'm just going to use uh, the electrical tape since I'm not keeping this car, so I don't even care about the wiring. So, yeah. So, I'm done here. Put the stock, uh, the stereo. I'm not keeping. Um, put the center piece. I haven't put this on because um, I still gotta do the gas lid and I need access to the back over here, uh, which that's next. Still need the rims. Um, and that's about it. The rims, gas lid, and that's it. This car is back to stock on tail lights. And there you go, the lid is on. I put the plastics back on. Now to take off those brand new tires off of that and put the used tires I got over there. Some stock GTS rims that I have there laying around. Um, these are brand new. I'm gonna keep them. I'm gonna put it on my girl's car and let her enjoy her new tires, especially these needles over here. So All right, so now we're taking off the exhaust. Uh, for this, we're only gonna need a couple of screwdrivers, some WD40. If you have some, I don't. makes things a lot easier for the hangers. Um, a jack and a jack stands. And a size 14. You only have two screws that go right there. Two 14s, and that's it. And they didn't install this one right. But fuck it, we're taking it off. So. Okay, exhaust is off. You got a hanger here, a hanger over there. You see it? One right here. The other one is right there. Um, and another one over here, which is hmm, the one that goes right there. Uh, should be right there. So we're all done. Just clean it up. 
Um, reason we took so long is because we were messing with the TRD over there that's going to be for sale. Um, and that's about it. Calling it a day. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and leave a comment or a suggestion. I'm out.